let's compare the basic functionality of the old registration paper hammer and the new original Schmidt Live print. So let's start with the registration paper hammer. Before measuring, you would generally open the compartment and roll the paper along to make a gap from the previous measurement. Then we can begin measuring. As you can see, the instrument is a little bit bulky to hold in order to make the impacts. Each impact is recorded by the slider on pressure sensitive paper in the form of a bar chart. So also warm up impacts will be recorded and also series that you don't particularly want to save will also be recorded. Let's look at the results. With a little care, we can actually read the figures from the bar chart to an accuracy of maybe plus minus one R. Now let's look at the original Schmidt Live print. As you can see, it's a very compact hammer without the bulky paper roll apparatus. This allows us to perform the impact series in a comfortable manner. Each impact is recorded digitally on the hammer, which has a memory for up to 20,000 impacts. When we finished the series, we can display the entire series on the digital display of the hammer. This is much faster and much less prone to error than trying to interpret a bar chart. If you decide that the series is good and you would like to have a printout, you can do this directly from the hammer to the Bluetooth printer seen here. Not only that, unlike the old registration paper hammer, you can detach the printout immediately for putting into your report.